All right, guys. Sorry about that. Trying to get some stuff taken care of. And plus, I was in on Gary's live. Uh, before I start and before I say hello to everybody, uh, <laughs> uh, well, I guess I didn't get that done. So would like to thank uh, Cooking with Bobby Joe. Nothing but love. Peaceful Dez, a member of the channel. Ralph, Webb's Web, a member of the channel. Simon, yes, I can. Barbecue member of the channel and YouTube police. Uh, thank you all for coming in. We have 14 people in here right now. And uh, I'm going to do the rest of the mail calls that I have put off, not because I just put them off, but because I haven't had time to do them. Now, I need to do something real quick because I don't know why it didn't download that in MP. I guess because there was an update. Ralph, was there an update? Because I haven't used DaVinci in a while. Uh, was there an update in oh, YouTube? That's why I didn't do that. Uh, let's do this. Add a render key. There we go. And um, intro MP4. Sorry about this, guys. Uh, trying to get something done here, and I was working on it. <laughs> And, uh, oh, got some more people. Uh, Rick, Wolfstein Outdoors, Rebecca Touched by Yarn, Radio Jonesy on Tour, DJ's Cartoon Universe. Thank you all for coming in. My wife hasn't even come in yet. Thanks, Jamie. Appreciate you coming in. She ain't even here. Uh, so I have that rendering, and I'm going to play this, and then I'm going to open my the rest of my mail. Uh, so I appreciate everybody coming in. 19 people here. And I got to gotta give me just a second. Hey, Gary, talk. <laughs> hey, y'all. How y'all doing? You know, part of the issue that I'm running into yeah. is I'm having trouble finding all the channels that you're doing mail calls for. You know, you probably, you know, but it is that time of year. So I understand why we're doing, hey, 911 operator. Hey, Wolf's Den Outdoors. Good to see you. Hey, Waffles is here, too. Good to see y'all. Uh, Peaceful day is always a pleasure, Nancy. Good to see you. Uh, Ralph at Webb's Web. Simon. Uh, I got nothing. I ain't got 911 it. operator. Oh, yeah. Uh, the, uh, what's his I little, what's his little uh, icon or avatar up there? Uh, girl Waffles, how you doing? Um, let me see. Um, it's so small, I couldn't see it. Well, I, I think there's a way to fix that. And, no. Oh, am I on mine? Am I, go, am I going to this channel or something? Uh, yeah, something oh, okay. like that. All right. Well, while he's doing that, I do got it done now. And I threw this together in like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. And so these are basically the rules of the channel. It can be changed at any time, but let me show you this. I'll be right back, guys. I lost my best friend to 23. She left her body and hovered above me. I saw no shadow. I looked around. Searched every building and home that I found. I saw no shadow, but felt a glow. The warmth inside me kept me afloat. Felt like heaven. I found my bones. And gave me comfort. There you go. There's the rules of the channel, and always like remember, remember our fallen. Remember POWs and MIAs, and uh, no negativity. Have fun, and if, if I do open up the panel and you come up on panel, don't talk over people. Yield the right away. Let them say what they're gonna say before uh, Otis. Otis, don't talk over people. <laughs> hey, Jason, how you doing? Thanks for coming in. Looks like 911 operators says I stand with Trump I, and a flag hanging down. Okay. Um, they're bound to be good people. <laughs> All right, guys. Welcome. Uh, thanks, everybody, for coming in. Hey, Jason. And let me, let, you, or let me know what you think of that little video that I played. Like I said, it was just a quick one. Uh, 
and remember our fallen who have died for our freedoms here. Uh, yes, uh, my girl Waffles, God bless Australia and America. Amen. And, and God bless Texas. <laughs> of course, God bless Texas. That's okay. Right. Let's get to the rest of my mail calls. And guys, I started them last week. And um, these are going to be the last of the mail calls that I have that I have not had time to uh, to do special videos for. So hopefully, as I get more mail eventually, hopefully I'll go back to being able to put together a little bit something more special. And uh, shout out the channel a little bit more. Gary, uh, I didn't, I don't have it pulled up. You want to be able to drop links and pull up their I was, channels? I was going to, but as I told you, I couldn't find zombie preppers, so I hadn't looked any of them up. Well, come on, Gary, get with the program. I'm trying. Okay, this one is from, okay, zombie prepper. <laughs> let's, let's move on. Let's save zombie prepper. Okay, this is Kentucky Prepper 5. This is Gary. You can find his channel, right? I'm sure I can. Okay, good. And then uh, as you share the screen, if you once I open, once I do the mail call. Am I sharing your share, screen or mine? You're going to share your screen. Okay. And because you can, hey, Judy May, Judy May, Judy May. How you doing? Thanks What's for coming Judy in. May, Judy May, Judy May. I, awesome, hey, Simon. Simon. Awesome, Simon. I appreciate that. Bear my super. <laughs> All right. Hold on one second. Yes, beat my super. That's what he meant. He said, beat my super. That is how I do. That is how I do my super chats. Anything a dollar ninety nine or less, I will not play the super chat. But Simon, yes, I can. Barbecue did the dollar ninety nine, so he's the first one on the board. So we play that for him. Thank you very much, Simon. I appreciate that. And uh, now we'll. Okay, good. Gary dropped the link. And, and then, you, Gary, when I after I open this and everything, if you would tell a little bit about Kentucky uh, or Kentucky Prepper 5, Gary, and read his about section, you know, that'd be great. And hold on a minute, Gary, before we before we get to my mail calls, there is another super chat. Thank you very much, Des. Five dollars. Here you go. And this is for you, Des. All right, and guys, if you are not connected to Simon, yes, I can barbecue who's in the barbecue community, but he also goes all over. Please connect to him. Simon, if you could uh, type DD, not 29, you're in my <laughs> DD, just to drop your link. So if anybody's not connected to you, they can connect to you. And Des, uh, if, if y'all are not connected to Peaceful Des, her channel is about positivity and hippies and Volvos and uh, red sunflowers. <laughs> no, she has a uh, live on Friday nights. And um, if y'all could connect to her, we go hang out and talk to her and everything else. So Des, Simon, you son of a gun. Uh, and Des, Des, if you could type DD. <laughs> yeah, funny MBL. You're already subbed to both of them. All right. Now let's get to the mail call. <laughs> I might start using my bigger knife. Okay, okay. This is well, that's that way. I only got a one swipe, you know, so it goes all the way through. 
So we have Chucky Prepper 5, Gary, and this Gary, uh, Bell of 29, YouTube Police, dropped his link, and we'll go over his channel here in a minute. And I have stickers here from Kentucky Prepper 5. And my green screen may mess with them a little bit, but, and it says, these are my current channel stickers. I will be ordering more in the near future from you all. I like this design, but want something more robust with the uh, UV protection. Thank you for all your help. Kentucky Prepper 5, Gary. That was a note from him. And uh, he, so these are his current stickers, but he plans on getting another sticker. Does he still have these stickers, Gary, or is it a different one now? Uh, I think that's the same one that's used as, as an icon right now. Okay, so he's wanting to get another one. And uh, I might have to get a hold of him and uh, see what he's looking for and try to help him out. And look at that, Kentucky Prepper 5, Matthew 24, 16 on his little banner up top. And he has 1.49 thousand subscribers, 153 videos, and he drops videos about prepping, and they're very informative. He does giveaways sometimes and everything else. All right, Gary, if you want to read his about page for us. Sure. Um, does he have an about page? Yeah, um, you were just on it. That's, okay. how it. that's how they redid it. See the about? Yeah, I've been doing emergency preparedness for 14 years now. I'm a certified firefighter, basic and advanced first aid instructor. Oh, just be quiet. You don't, you can't read. Uh, CPR, AED instructor and stop the bleed instructor. Tis this channel. We'll talk about all the things prepper related. I really enjoy the outdoors. A lot of trapping. I'll just stop it. Trapping when the season is open. Thank you for st sh stopping by and following me. I truly appreciate it. And don't, please don't forget to subscribe. I tend, uh, I just had some stickers printed. So if you'd like one, send me an email. I'd be glad to send you one. KYPrepper5 at gmail.com. That is awesome, but I didn't know that Kentucky Prepper 5 had a, a dog named Otis in, in the about section. All right, I'll see you later. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> hey, I, Otis is over here. He wants down now. He was happy for a while on the seat. But... Hey, Simon said it's time for an Otis hug, Gary. No, Otis don't want a hug. He just wanted me to put him down off the chair. So if y'all are not con connected to Gary Kentucky Prepper 5, please go check out his channel. Thank Gary dropped a link. And so our next mail call, non-domestic, what is that? Who's non-domestic? Anyways, is from Neil and Beth Cornett. Oh, hi, AJ. AJ, what's up? Yeah, that's You're doing pretty good. Old man. <laughs> okay. You remember him, don't you? Hey, AJ. AJ, I think was wanting to get away from Nikki. Look at that long tongue. <laughs> yeah. She's a sweetie. She's a sweetie. Yeah. You got the the best puppy dog eyes, I think. They always look like they're begging for something. <laughs> Well, I think, uh, honestly, I think Rosemary is the prettiest puppy we have. Um, hey, Gary, that's mean. <laughs> well, this one's sweeter than, than Rosemary, but uh, Rosemary just has the look. You know? <laughs> uh, Simon says, oh, AJ gets you two time, but not Otis, huh, Gary? Well, Otis needs a haircut. <laughs> Yeah. All well, right, Waffles, you have a good night. I think Otis just knows when a live stream starts and he likes he likes trolling. <laughs> Otis the troll. And uh, but these you know these puppies are sweet. Yes, they're very <laughs> sweet puppy dogs. And but Nikki, 
Nikki was laying down here on the bed, and when when AJ uh, um, came up, I think um, AJ was. I think Nikki was getting a little defensive, started biting her on the back leg and looked like she was about to grab her ear. So I had to pick AJ, uh, AJ up. AJ can't take care of herself, huh? Well, she's Rosemary just a can. Bit, she's more timid. She's Rosemary. more timid than Rosemary. Rosemary Rosemary's can. a little listen, but she's feisty. <laughs> she don't she don't think twice about jumping on on Nikki. And she's about half her size. <laughs> but, you know, and funny thing is, uh, Nikki, or uh, this dog is almost the same size as Nikki, but it took her forever to learn how to jump on some of the stuff around here. And, and you know, uh, uh, Rosemary at half her size was jumping up on just about everything around here. What's AJ looking at? Nikki. Oh, <laughs> Nikki's right down here in the bed, right beside me, and uh, I don't know. I think Nikki sometimes. Um, I think AJ feels like Nikki's picking on her. I think, but I don't know. Poor AJ. I'm gonna let I you like know. Hey, you you leave her alone, Nikki. Okay, come here, get back. Come on, let me show. Let me show. She, Nikki. Nicole, Nikki, Nikki, hi Nikki. You hear? You hear? Nikki, hear what are you doing? What are you doing, Nikki? Nicole, bye bye, Nicole. <laughs> now she's going to bite on AJ. Well, she stopped at on at the bed. Now she's trying. Nikki's trying to bite AJ. I think AJ's just trying to get by her. Or maybe she wants on the bed and Nikki's trying to protect her place. I don't know. But ain't no reason for me to be big of fine. All right. Well, you had the dog a minute ago. I wasn't big of fine you. I was big of fine AJ and Nikki. That makes sense. All right. Neil and Beth Cornette. Okay. You want to look their stuff up? I already got it pulled up. Okay, cool. Well, I ain't ready for them yet. Okay. I'm going to open my mail call first. Okay. All right. Okay. Here we go. Which is Being Us Odyssey or uh, what's the other channel there, Gary? Neil's got Neil. Uh, Neil. Treasure Hunter. Treasure Neil. Hunter. Yep. All right. I got a purple. There's a purple heart uh, stamp on there. And. It's a thank you card. And it says, thank you, Jamie and Eddie, for helping us on our logo and making our stickers. Beth and Neil Cornett. Very nice. Yeah, I helped uh, Beth and Neil design it, and then they ordered stickers from Jamie. Okay, go to their channel, Gary. All right. Bring it up now. Wait a minute. Drop their link, or do I need to go do that? I've got their link. I just okay. you know, trying to okay. do three things at one time don't exactly work well here. Okay, you can close Kentucky Purple Fight. Well, never mind. You just do you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay. Okay. I had to be on the other one soon so I could drop the link. I got you. No problem. So hang on. I got a solution to it. I'll just move this one over here. And then I'll have access to these, uh, these so I can, etc. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Being us Odyssey, they have 81 subscribers, seven videos, and that's Beth and Neil, which is being us or B. Beth is for Beth and is for Neil, and then us Odyssey. And you want to read the about there, Gary? You know, I would think you could read these. My voice is giving out. Uh, hello, okay. we're, we're Neil and Beth Cornett. This is just our odyssey through life, just being us. This channel, this channel is a video record of our grand 
to spend more time with us because we don't see them enough. It's also a way for other tubers to connect with us. Go ahead. All right. And um, you have Neil's up there too or not? Treasure Hunter Neil? No, I don't. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so, you want to drop his link? And I'm about to. Yeah, 76, 76 subscribers. Don't look like he has any videos on there. And you want to hit the more section? The more? Okay. And he doesn't have anything on his about section. So, being us Odysseys, their main channel. And then this is Treasure Hunter Neil uh, of BNN. This is Neil. Uh, he does have a separate channel that he goes on as a supporter. All right. Let's go to the next one. The next one is going to be Danny Days Ahead. Now, me and Danny did sticker swaps before. So I have a little Hallmark card here. And these are her new stickers that she had sent me. It's kind of hard to see here. There we go. And it says, Dee Dee, I know I picked at you but i wouldn't if i didn't like you a little bit anyway lol i truly appreciate you supporting me on my channel love danielle danny days ahead aka the other dd lol <laughs> and uh let's go to her channel now and that's danny at danny days ahead and she has one point one thousand subscribers 247 videos and then on her about section it says hey there i'm danielle my channel is for connecting sharing learning and growing i am sharing my journey and i have one of those thanks to the lord subscribe and see where this journey takes us thank you and i hope you find something you like she has her email address there and her paypal address there so you can email her or PayPal her, and that is Danny. I've known her for quite some time. Uh, a lot of times she goes up on, she'll show up on DJ sometimes. She'll go on Al Chase, My Back Steps, on Lazy Days Ahead with Jesse and Lisa, and uh, Miss Andell. She's all over the place. So if y'all are not subscribed to Danny at Danny Days Ahead, uh, go subscribe to her. And I'm sure Gary... Drop the link. Hey, Twin Brook Acres, thanks for coming in. And uh, okay, we'll go to the next one. We're down to four. I'm down to four. Wait, five. <laughs> I'm down to five. Okay, this next one is from Gail Southern Living. And Gail's from Texas as well. Gail Southern Living. Uh, if I can get it open. There we go. And it's a card. It says, you're the best. See, Gary, I'm the best. Did you get one of these from Gail there, Gary? I don't know. I got, I got a Gail Southern Living sticker, which I do not have. Well, I did not have. And it says, Devil Dog. Thank you so much for helping me with Nightbot. I appreciate it very much. Have a blessed day. Sincerely, Gail at Gail Southern Living. Well, thank you very much, Gail. And here is Gail's channel. And Gary will drop the link. Okay. And uh, MK, MK Gaming YouTube. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate that. Uh, you know, your microphone seems to be... Uh, Mine? Yeah. Stay Seems a bit. 
stay closer to the mic. It seems to help. Hold on. Let me just turn up my gain. How about that? Okay. Uh, there, that better? Yeah. Yeah, I just turned up my gain a little bit. Let me know if it's too loud. All right. Gail Southern Living has 2,820 some odd subscribers. She has 1,800 and some videos. And you can go ahead and click on the link, uh, the more area, Gary. And on her about, she has her, her email address up there. And it says, Gail Southern Living is about my journey with cooking, gardening, raising chickens, crafts, traveling, prepping, and working on our homeless ministry. I am in Central Texas, Growing Zone 8A. I'm in 9A. What, what's, what gardening zone are you in, Gary? I think I'm in uh, 8B. 8B, maybe 9, 9A. I don't think you're in 9A. I think you're north of 9A. Well, it, why, like don't you, said, why don't you why don't you maybe 8B? Why don't you why don't you look that up? What gardening zone you're in? While I finish this, okay. I'm in Central Texas, growing zone 8A. I was born and raised in Texas. God bless Texas, right, Gary? Yeah. I live in a small city now. I have four cats, 17 chickens, and some fish. Okay, I don't have any cats. I have four dogs. I have four goats. I have four turkeys, and I have we. Well, Jamie has like. Over thirty some chickens or whatever, we get like thirty to thirty two eggs a day usually. Uh, don't have any fish either. I've had fish in the past, but anyways, I have been married for seven years and I have two stepdaughters. I am a Christian. My mother and I started a homeless ministry in December of tw- two thousand twenty two. After we found out my sister had been homeless in Colorado, my. Si- <coughs> 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 Sorry about that. <coughs> what? I'm sorry. Do you want me to leave this up here for a minute? Yeah, I'm not finished yet. I I choked. You my choke sister, all the time. <coughs> my sister got hit by a car in Colorado, crossing the street while walking with her bags. Mom named our ministry Broken Hearts Ministry. I hope you enjoy my channel and subscribe. Have a blessed day. And she has her P.O. box there in Breckenridge, Texas. And thank you very much, Gary. And I will be right back. Okay. So, by the way, just going to say, hey, uh, I saw, well, Judy May, Pest Hunter Outdoors. And I am in Zone 8B, MK Gaming YouTube. Uh, let see... Rip Curl Readiness, good to see you. Uh, Twin Brook Acres, you know, I'm just saying hello to everybody. Peaceful Des, of course. Danny is awesome. She's good people. I met her over in uh, at the uh, Pedal to the Path as well. Um, at least I think so. Seems like it. Hey, hey, Kyle, good to see you. How y'all doing? Okay. I'm just playing, having a little fun. I expect Devil Dog was having a little issue with, uh, you know, getting choked up. You know, he's maybe maybe he's just real sentimental. That's a possibility. So, y'all remember subscribe, hit that like button if you like the material, um, or hit the dislike button if you, you know. It still counts, from what I hear. Some people, you know, some people they have a tendency to go to, you know some streams just to go through it. Now, why did Devil Dog leave? And come? I don't know. Doesn't matter. I don't know why I did either. I think I hit the browser back button. You had to kick me out the studio. <laughs> and don't okay. get a treat every time. Do not get a treat every time. Go lay down. Want to say hi? Come here. Oh, hey, Brett's here with butt nuggets. <laughs> oh, Rob, Brett. Uh, KK's Travel and Educational Vlogs. Thanks for coming in, guys. Just, uh, Opening up, so I get off of the desk. You get off the desk. Quit being like Otis. He's a bad influence on you. Go lay down. Otis ain't never even met. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See, that's what I'm talking about. She's heard Otis bark before, and that's... See what it started? Yeah. <clears throat> All 
All right. The next one is from Carl Hill, chilling Indiana Carl. And I got a little, uh oh. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, yep, this is a Christmas card. <laughs> it's got a little wreath right there. And uh, it was. Well, look at the bright side. You're only five and a half months late. It was post dated 12 December 2023. <laughs> so I know this is a Christmas card. And uh, we'll get to that one right now. <laughs> and it says, Winter Wishes. <laughs> In the middle of summer. Hey, was it Christmas in July? Hey, I'm early, Gary. I'm early. This is Christmas in July, bro. It well, says wishing okay. you, <laughs> wishing you. What uh, month? Warm- you said December or? Hey, Gary, hush. I, I'm trying to read, Gary. Oh wait, I got to bigger find myself and get you off air. Anyways, it says uh, wishing you, wishing you warm and wonderful blessings of the season. See, warm, Gary. It's hot. It's like 86 degrees here. Merry Christmas, Eddie, to you and your family. Chilling Indiana, Carl. (laughs) You've got mail. (laughs) Wait, what's it? You've got mail. Oh, Rob Barry, Storms Radios and Cats. Thank you for coming in. And the Bud Files. How you doing? Thank you for coming in. Oh, Rob. And Charlie or Brandy Pafford. Thank you all for coming in. All right. Hey, Brandy. Always a pleasure to see you, Don. All right. Here we go. Chilling Indiana Carl. He has 255 subscribers and 12 videos, and he is a great supporter. Uh, Chilling Indiana Carl has been, I've known him for almost the two years that I have been on YouTube. And you want to go to his about section there, Gary? Hang on, I'm saying uh saying hello to Charlie because it's Charlie, not Brandy. Good to see you. Can't say Charlie or Brandy, whoever it is. Well, he said Charlie. Okay, well, hey Charlie, how you doing? I Thanks for coming in, Charlie. Brandy. What? I thought you said Brandy. I said Charlie or Brandy. Oh, my bad. I'll have to review that and look at it. All right. Did you drop Carl's link yet? I did. Okay, good. On his about section, it says, Welcome to Chillin' Indiana, Carl. Just enjoying the outdoors fishing, kayaking, and sharing lures and baits of the great bait markers of YouTube. I'm sorry, bait makers of YouTube. Be sure to check out. And then he has Ugly Dog Lures. And he also has Fishing with Mo Dog. So he is promoting Ugly Dog Lures and Fishing with Mo Dog on his channel. Y'all guys, Charles uh, or Carl's a great guy. He got me saying Charles, Charlie. Uh, <laughs> hush, Barry. <laughs> uh, y'all check out uh, Chilling Indiana Carl. He's a great guy, uh, great supporter. And uh, Gary had dropped his link. So if you're not connected to Carl, please go connect with him. We are down to three. <laughs> Two, right. one. No. <laughs> okay, can't do zombies yet because you can't find zombie. How can you not find zombie prepper? I think I'm down to maybe the last one before zombie. No, we have uh, this one and this one and I zombie. Only two. Huh? I, got, I only got one more. No, we have Ernest. I don't know Ernest. Ernest Tubbs. Jamie, no, Jamie told you who Ernest was. Oh yeah, but I, I didn't, I didn't know that one. He told, she told you. She showed me a thing, but I didn't. I still don't no, know who that, that is. That wasn't this one, dude. I'm, I'm open. I don't know. You expect? Okay. You think I'm a YouTuber, a good YouTuber, dude. I how many? Hey, Judge Webb. Hey, LAP. <laughs> Ura Webb. Hoorah, LAP Coins. Thanks for coming in, guys. <laughs> you act like I'm supposed to be good at this. All right. Let's see what we got here. We oh, have no, no, only got one more pulled up. We have some stickers. This is River Rat. 3030. Yeah, I got that one. Yeah, I this got, is River Rat. Ernest River Rat. Ernest is River Rat. Okay. 
And these you are sure? some cool stickers. Jamie, make these stickers. See, we have this one. River at 3030. Right. And my well, green screen's that. messing with it a little bit. Huh? I've got River Rat. Yeah. Know, 30, 30. And then we got this one. Hey, Jamie. Oh, let, shouldn't you be megafied? Oh, yeah. Okay. I got you. This one? And hey, have a good night, Twin Brook Acres. This one. So... River Red 3030, thank you very much for the stickers. And I got two left. Jay Casario and Zombie Prepper. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's go to River Rat's channel. Hold on. I've got it pulled up. Okay. Oh, you got there we go. Bigify, you said. All right. River Rat 3030. He has 1,950 1, some odd subscribers. He has 426 videos and some cool stickers and stuff, it looks like. And on his About section, it says, if you need my address, it is Ernest Smith, and the address is 517 Oletta Drive, Dallas, North, Car North Carolina, 28034. Email is river at 3030 at gmail.com, or you can find me on Facebook. He's kind of like me, an open book. I enjoy fishing and showing and watching great people who do the same. <clears throat> I love supporting great people and their channel. I really enjoy people's company and chatting. I do mailbox call videos when people send things and try to promote other channels, but I wish I could just fish all the time. That makes two of us. I just love it so much, but if you like what I do, check me out and subscribe. It's free and go check out Modog, the second person that <clears throat> has Modog as far as shouting them out. On their about section, great channel, also amazing fisherman in person, and the Mo Pups, they bass whisper is what I call him. Thanks, everyone. I hope you enjoy my channel, and always, God bless you all, River Rat 3030. Y'all go check out River Rat, subscribe to his channel, especially if you like fishing and stuff, uh, and you, I'm sorry? Uh, so, who was it? Somebody was saying I needed to post River Rat's channel, not mine. I did who, post his channel. Uh, Jason, right, Tiffany. Jason, I did post his a link to their channel. That's River Rat's channel right there, River Rat 3030. What's good to see you, Judge Webb, obviously. And Jason, hey, good to see you. LAPD Coins. Tiffany, good to see you, darling. <laughs> um, but that is the link. I've checked it twice already. That is you know, his his channel. Uh that's his channel uh, link. I'll check it again. Yep, goes to River Rats. Oh, that's okay, Jason. But I swear that is his channel link. I've checked it four times. I swear I have. You okay, Eddie? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm looking for Zombie Prepper's channel. Oh, yeah. I'm. Uh, did you not find it or did you find it? I did not, but the, I got another way to look. So give me just a second and I'll okay. see if it's on there. I got one more way to see, and they, it may not be a, available on uh, where I'm thinking about. So I'll just have to look and see. Could very easily not be there. But I'm gonna try. Hang on. <laughs> Let's see. I'm trying to look for zombie preppers too. I'm looking for it. Yeah, me too. If anybody has Robert Zombie Preppers uh channel, if you could drop the link. He, had, he lost his channel for a while, and then he was under another one. Well, let me, okay, let me go ahead and open this up. Maybe it, it's a sticker. Yeah, it's a sticker. Let's see what it looks like. And then he got his channel back, so he was doing it under, you remember what the other channel was, Gary? 
I don't remember. I do not recall. Asking me to remember something is asking is like <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. It's like talking to you about numbers. Down home. Down home. That's, that's <laughs> simple, right? Try looking up down home. See if that brings up anything. Oh, see, here's the thing. I got two of his stickers, and I've never had zombie prepper stickers, and I mentioned it, and he finally sent them out. When did he send them? <laughs> hey. Oh, I don't want to tell when he sent them. <laughs> so we have his down-home sticker, and my green screen's messing with it because his is all in green. Uh, let's try to turn off my green screen. Was it down home prepper or just down home? Down home. Just down home. See, right here, down home. All right. See, that's what it looks like. That's what his uh, icon looks like. Okay, I'm looking for it. And then we have the zombie prepper. This is actually his new one because he had an old one. And this is his new sticker, I think. See that zombie prepper? Yeah. I honestly don't see it. It says zombie prepper prepared. But anyway, zombie prepper is an awesome guy. He is a preacher and he is a good, uh, good, awesome guy. He's very likable. Yep, he is. He's always very chill, very mellow. Uh, and uh, Zombie's a great guy. Uh, if <laughs> he, He's kind of been off YouTube a little bit so and hasn't been around as much. And like I said, he had issues with his channel. So... Uh, Anyways, when he if he comes in, when he comes in to my channel, I'll get find out, drop his link. And I know I'm subscribed to him. I know I got the bell ring for him, but I just haven't seen much of him lately. All right, my last mail call is from I don't know. <laughs> we'll see what it is though. He says Ura on the front. Somebody going live, it looks like. Give me one second. <laughs> Simon, my life's a seven. <laughs> he sends me a text. Simon says, what time's your live? It's the same time it's been for two years, Simon. <laughs> All right. This has some medical tape on the back sealing it. So trying to cut it without cutting anything that's in there. Yes, yes, she subscribed to both channels and cannot find them. Who is? Des? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he turned it off or something. He may have. Who knows? All right. Let's see what this is. Okay. Yeah. Ah. Okay, cool. Um, this is a patch, and I think... I, I, it's been a while. <laughs> it's been a, a while, but I do remember Jake, uh, cat, uh, Jay. Where, okay. Everything. Okay. It says rub some dirt on it. Everything stops bleeding eventually. And I do remember this, but, uh, I just got it. Just opened it. And I don't remember the channel. Um, because he didn't put his channel name on there. He just put his name. 
but I know exactly where I'm going to put this. And it, it is a patch with Velcro and everything. And see, it's got the, the Velcro and then that you stick to it. So that is pretty cool. It's real cool. And I know exactly where I'm going to put it. <clears throat> so anyways, that's it for the mail calls. I'm all caught up. Ain't y'all proud of me? I am. <laughs> Des, ain't you proud of me? <laughs> that may, wait a minute. That means you ain't got no waiting mail? No waiting mail. That's it. I'm done. Yeah, I'm caught up. I'm proud of you. Unless I find something laying around somewhere, but I don't think so. <laughs> oh, okay, let's drop the link, Gary. Let's see if people want to come up. Okay. I'm still looking, so go ahead. Okay. <laughs> there we go. There's the link if anybody needs that deal says finally. Hey, check your uh, uh voice mod. I what I sound like. I didn't get it back. Would you let her come over here if she wants to? Okay, there we go. Come here, baby girl. Uh, Come here. One of my puppies wants to see me. That's AJ. She yeah, already right. been up there. She just wants, she's a camera. Camera hog? Yeah. Well, she just likes, you know, Nikki was trying to get her from coming to come over. Uh, she was trying, Nikki was putting herself between me and her to where she's blocking her. <laughs> she thinks she, hey, AJ, Alexa. Alexa, what are you? What's she doing? Camera hog. You just think you're a star, huh? Well, honestly, I think she just likes coming over and me holding her. NBL said Eddie sound purdy. There it is. Hang on. No, don't flood Eddie with no more mail. Eddie's fine. Not you. What? No. I found Nancy, I think I found the channel. Nancy said flood Eddie with more mail. No, don't flood Eddie with more mail. Well, to be fair, you could probably go through and uh, you could probably go through and send you mail for 2029. No, I'm going to try to keep up with my mail calls now. Thank you very much, Gary. You're welcome. As long as it don't all come in at the same time, I'll try to do them one at a time. Come here, sweetheart. If but, you want to stare over there, let me hold you like this. That's what she's, she's doing. Like at Nikki. Nikki's looking at Char her like, what are you doing up there? Charlie and Brandy, how y'all been doing? I know Charlie was there, now it's Brandy, so how y'all been doing? Hey, Brandy. Did you uh, put the link in? Yes, I did, and it's pinned at the top. Okay. Nobody wants to come. Nobody wants to come talk, see me. But and no well, one me. If I leave, maybe they'll. Maybe they'll <laughs> no, hey, up. let me ask you a question. I'm here. Did hey? Did anybody comment on that little video yeah. thing that I played earlier? Oh, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I like the song. It seems like I've used it before. Oh well, thanks, Gary. Well, there, I, there's a lot of music that I've used, Eddie. I mean, you know, it, yeah, I, of course, you've done like a million videos, you know, so exactly. So it ain't like, you know, the chances of you finding one that's a good video or a good song that I hadn't used is fairly rare. So, in other words, I ought to quit using all the music just because no, you No, I'm not before. saying that, but if you uh -huh. really want, you can go into my audio music thing, and, and I've already no, started. that's all right. I'm fine. Are you pouting again? <laughs> you know, Charlie uh, Charlie and Brandy, every time we pass y'all, uh, me and Sammy, I always yell out the window, Charlie or Brandy or something like that. I can verify that. And I've actually seen Brandy in uh, walking or something, and I yell out the window, Brandy! <laughs> hey, Huga, thanks for coming in. 
the link is pinned at the top, and if nobody wants to come up, then whatever. Well, well, what? They, I maybe, mean, maybe they, maybe, maybe, maybe they I'll, don't like me. You know, actually, I guess Jonesy really is using the chainsaw <laughs> during my life. <laughs> uh, <laughs> It, it's me because Sammy would just be blowing the horn. He blows the horn at everything. Freaking a dog's in the road, a bird's in the road. Anything is in the road, he'll honk the horn. And then he honks the horn at drivers all the time. Hi, Des. Hey, and it's not you. I, I put B right back. I had to use the ladies' room. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Sammy is the worst driver, but Sammy's on vacation. He's going to be gone this week, so it is only going to be me and his grandson, Hunter. We're going to be trying to do the work by ourselves, I guess. Um, and then earlier today, uh, I haven't had a shower or anything because ever since I got up today, we've been on the run. We went to the post office and mailed stuff out. And then we went and got chicken feed and goat feed. And then we came home and dropped that off. Oh, Russia. Thanks for tapping in, brother. Um, then we went and got uh, chicken feed, goat feed, dropped it off, hooked up the trailer, went and got a cubic yard of garden soil, came back, jumped in the other car. Me and Jamie went and got something to eat, came back, and then we started – Filling up those, I made a short video. I don't know if Gary watched it, probably not, of me building planter boxes. <laughs> I don't watch your material, Eddie. I know, no. Gary. It's I all right, Gary. It's video. all right, Gary. You don't need to watch it. And so we filled up a swimming pool and a planter box, and Jamie planted all of her uh, seeds that she's, uh, what's it called, Gary? Planter box. No, not incubated, but uh, no, not incubated, but you know, germination, uh, germination, germ germinated, germinated. <laughs> so she germinated a bunch of seeds. Non -gardener. She had salads growing in these bags, man. These these things were sprouted and everything else, and so we planted more cantaloupes, more I think cucumbers, lettuce, radishes, a bunch of stuff. And then we replanted her tiger lilies, uh, double orange tiger lilies, and her stargazer lilies in the front. And uh, so we redid all that. And as soon as we got that done, uh, we didn't. We don't have enough dirt to do the big box that I put up front. Uh, we're gonna have to get more dirt later. But as soon as we did all that, we uh, it started raining on us. And then one of my neighbors brought over some goat feed and left it on the front steps and because he always hears our goats ban i guess he got rid of his or whatever and so we didn't know who dropped it off or anything else we come home and it was there and so we weren't going to feed it to our goats you know because not knowing where it came from you didn't know if somebody you know wants to kill your goats or what and poison the food or whatever but then he came back over and uh he said, Did you get that go feed that I left? He said, I seen all that chicken feed, but anyway, so yeah, I bought four bags of chicken feed today and a bag of goat feed because one of the bags of chicken feed goes to the turkeys, the other three goes because we're getting about 30, 32 eggs a day. And so um, nice. Yeah, so and then all our plants are pretty much other than that in that where I built a shade house. And it's a learning experience for us because where I built that shade house at that bottom part, when it rains and stuff, it floods. And three of my cantaloupes have been in the water too long and they died. But everything else out there has been growing and doing pretty dang good and everything. So nice. we got just about, we got, we got a lot of stuff planned. We got lettuce, cabbage, uh, broccoli, cauliflower, okra, corn, um, Watermelon, cantaloupe, pumpkins. We got, I mean, squash, uh, tomatoes, cucumbers. We got a lot of stuff planted. And then next year, so everything's learning experience. So next year we're gonna get more dirt, 
after this and we're going to build up that bed a little bit so when it rains and stuff it don't flood and it don't sit under the you know water and die and stuff like that but we planted more cantaloupe too we got different kinds of watermelons too we got the Can't little watermelons like a, do you have a um do you have a, like a wire sorry let me talk over do you have a wire something wire that you can make an arch and have the vines go up over yeah, there's an arch there and stuff, but it the thing is, is it's sitting underwater, and if plants sit oh, underwater, the roots are, yeah, the roots yeah, are. if plants sit underwater for like three days, four days, it's gonna kill them. It's gonna. I do forget about that. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, we got the arch thing. We haven't put any. Yeah, and thanks, Charlie and Brandy. Uh, that's <laughs> the shade house that we built or built out there. Charlie and Brandy gave it to us. Nice. So, but it's been sitting out there and it's the first time the weather has been cooperative and, you know, we've had time and everything else, but it took a, a while to do it. But next year, though, we're going to get more dirt, more garden soil. It's garden soil that we're getting. And we're going to build up that area in under the shade house thing. We haven't put up shade yet because I don't know if we need it because where I planted, there's trees. So it gets, what's it called, Gary? What kind of shade? partial maybe no it's not dapple. partial. You, dapple that's what you called it before dapple shade or whatever it sun rises over there and it sets over there so when and my my shade house is over here so when it comes up it gets morning sun but then it comes through the trees too a little bit and then when it's up straight ahead it's get full sun and then when it comes over here in the afternoon the uh, trailer kind of shades it a little bit. So, uh, trying to find the mushroom soil. I don't know where Char Charlie or Brandy, whoever it is now, it, it, we go down, we, we went down to, uh, dirt cheap down there off 1960. And it is, uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing, Jason. We went, we went down the dirt cheap off 1960 and we get one cubic yard of garden soil, uh, put it on my trailer and it's 38 bucks. And so it fills up quite a bit. It's a lot of shoveling. By the way, dumping in the did, wagons. Did you say hello to Vintage Jewels, Gems and Pearls, and also mm -hmm. Devil Dog Prepper? Hold on. Hoorah, Devil Dog Prepper. Uh, and who else? Uh, vintage, vintage Jewels, vintage Gems Jules. and Pearls. Hoorah, thanks for coming in. They said hi, Dez. That's because I said hi to them. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they said new here. Uh, hi, everyone. New here. Okay. By the way. Well, I'm uh, glad that I'm glad to have you, Vintage Jewels, Gems, and Pearls. By the way, what? Good great people, but he's a little bit on the bristly side. Yeah. For example, he gets on to talking about me not watching his videos, but his last video, he has not released a new video called Planners, New Planner Boxes not since six days ago, which I watched that one, and he's put out three new ones on dead gum, you know, peacocks that I have watched as well and made comments on all of them. <laughs> hey, Gary, can you do me a favor? No. Yes. What? Can you <coughs> can you go into my YouTube studio real quick and answer, the, answer those comments on my videos? No. <laughs> We've tried that before. No, well, okay, well, you don't have to answer all of them. Just answer the ones from Belt Loop 29 or YouTube, please. <laughs> you know, I am a member, and I'm supposed to get preferential replies. <laughs> well, when I go to reply, I will reply to you first. Okay. <clears throat> I'm a member, too. That doesn't mean squat. <laughs> no here's the thing seriously since i've been working i have been working i mean That's i right. get up i get up before daylight okay i get up and leave like almost right at daylight and then this week i didn't get home till after six o'clock eight o'clock and everything else um several times and so by the time i get home i want to eat and i eat and you can ask des i mean and then uh, sometimes now, luckily, if I do get home at five or before five or a little bit after five, a lot of times I go feed my go to my turkeys and everything else. If I don't get home in time, Jamie feeds them a lot of times. So I don't even get to do that. And 
I get home, eat, and everything else, and then I'm pretty much ready to go to bed. Now, I will jump on people's lives and stuff sometimes, but I'm tired. Hey, Skip, uh, thanks for coming in, brother. But it's just like um, I've been beat. I, I haven't been YouTubing hardly any, you know, doing and see that the videos that I shot with the Peacock, we were out at work. And the peacocks are community peacocks is what the guy that lived there said. They, they're they all up and down the street around that community. They're wild. Okay. And so I got them. I recorded them on my phone. And then as soon as I could, I just uploaded them. You know, I didn't do no editing or anything else. It was quick videos, you know, to at least put some content out there. But I haven't had time to do hardly anything, especially go in and answer comments or something. I'm not good at answering comments on my phone. A lot of times I can't even find comments on my phone. That's true. Vintage Jewels, Gems, and Pearls says, come on over to the jewelry community, LOL. <laughs> Thank you very much, Des. Good night, Jason. You're Thanks welcome. for coming in, brother. Take it easy, Jason. So Ooh, Rob, Peter. What's up, brother? Appreciate you coming in. Hey, 19 Peter. people in the house. Uh, Peter, anybody, y'all are welcome Vintage, to come up on panel. Vintage Jewels. Uh, on panel. Uh, the link's pinned at the top. And Vintage Jewels, Gems, and Pearls, if you want to come up on panel and let us know a little bit about your channel and stuff, you're more than welcome to. Uh, just click on the link. Also drop your link with a DD. Oh, yeah. You can... Uh, <laughs> Rob's been a member for 17 months. Des for 15 months. Uh, Skip for 13 months. 13. I think Gary is like my first member ever. How long you been a member, Gary? Yeah. There you go. But y'all can drop. 17. See, him and Ralph became members at the same time. I was first. And Peter's been a member for a long time, too. How long? Peter dropped A long it? time, too, yeah. Uh, Peter, <clears throat> how long do you remember? Peter's been a member for a long time. These are my, my bros. And there's Huga's link. Hey, did you set up the, uh, what you call it, Gary? Redirect, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, Eddie, you, and, oh, hold on. Peter for 16, Oops. see? He's been right there. Uh, no, we're not conjoined twins there, MBO. <laughs> Who's that, you and, and MBO? Me and you. MBO's the one that said it. We... Oh. Eddie, you and Gary are conjoined twins, LOL. Well, yeah. you do tend to see us a lot together. That's because I enjoy his company. I don't know why, but I do enjoy his company. It's because yeah, I, I feel do. it's because I feel peer, peer pressure. <laughs> From who? <laughs> I'm lost. Gary, Gary makes me. He's a popo. <laughs> <laughs> he might arrest me if I don't come to his channel. <laughs> he knows where I live. <laughs> I have been there a time or two. Okay, here we go, guys. Vintage Jewels Gems. She's hello. How you doing? I'm good. Good. We're happy to have you. Uh, would you like to tell us a little bit about you? Did you type DD in the uh, in the chat so it'll drop your link so people can connect to you? Okay. Let me. I'll have to get that. I can get it. I can get it. But okay, uh, I've yeah. got it. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, Ramona. Thanks so, for coming in. <laughs> yeah. So I sell vintage jewelry, costume <laughs> jewelry, sterling silver, a little bit of everything, and um, lots now, of fun. Do you do that on like um, a? Uh, I, Hey, Devil Dog 2856, good to see you. 
Now, do you do that on like uh, a bid basis? Because I know I've seen some of them do that. Other people just have like a store that they have online. No, I do auctions. I do auctions. Hi, Mona. Okay. Um, yeah, I do auctions. Okay. And um, I just got off one. As a matter of fact, I was doing a dollar day sale today, to which I'm going to do another one tomorrow. Oh, so cool. cheap, cheap, cheap costume jewelry. Um, it's lots of fun, though. Everybody gets something they like. Oh, yeah. Now, I've got a friend of mine that does, you know, a lot of eBay stuff and, you know, he's got a card shop and all that. anything that turns, a, you know, that'll make a dollar. He has a tendency to do that. Um, is that your your only thing that you do? Uh, or do Right you now do it is. Right now it is. I want to branch out to eBay. I did open a store last year. But as soon as I opened it, they closed it for no reason at all. They wouldn't wow. give me a reason why they closed it. I hadn't even sold anything. I had literally just paid for the store mm -hmm. and was getting ready. I was taking pictures and getting ready to. And I'm not sure why, but they said I couldn't open one. Well, here's an, an idea for you. I'll just throw this out there. Hey, Jerry Butler, good to see you. Um, Devil Dog's here. He just probably went to the restroom or get a drink. Um, a friend, my friend that has the baseball card stuff and the eBay and all that other stuff. Uh, yeah, he, yeah. and he's a truck driver. Now, what he did is found a flea market, you know, place that has that sell that sets up different uh, areas in there. You might yeah. consider doing something like that. I'm just thinking out loud. Uh, uh, an actual flea market, you mean? Yeah, where they have different. They rent out different areas, and the people up front take care of everything. Um, they go by people. I think he goes by and checks on his spot from time to time. To time. Hey, Macy. Oh, family. you're talking more like you're talking more like a um, um. Oh my goodness, um, like a vintage store. I forgot what it's called. Um, antique mall. Antique mall. Antique mall. Like, like an antique mall. Yeah. 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 It's hard to get into any of them, though. If you ask anybody, it's usually a long waiting list. Really? And the people that already have stores in there get first choice if one comes open. So even if they already have one or two spaces, okay. people that are already in there have the choice to take over multiple. Well, I'm just thinking out loud. You might check on it. It may be another way if you do marketing already. It may be something, another avenue through which you can turn a profit. Yeah, always looking for that. Always. Hey, Jerry. My oh, brothers Jerry. Are, Jerry, my brothers are coming out tonight, man. There's Devil Dog Prepper in here, and there's Devil Dog 2856 in here. See, my Marines are here. It's a dog pound. There's, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> hey, Jerry. There's just you uh, in the Navy and uh, Ralph, Ralph in the Air Force. <laughs> yeah, but you all have fleas. So, speaking of that, real quick, um, everybody, uh, hold on one second. I'm gonna drop this link. <clears throat> speaking about stores and everything else, if you go to this link that I'm fixing to drop, it'll tell you who's live. It'll tell you uh, certain events that are coming up uh um it'll tell you who's live events that are coming up stores youtube stores um it's on the uh nightbot too there we go and uh but you can go right there to www.southernqa.com and there's uh people that have youtube stores uh it's on there there's a gallery of photos of beautiful flowers and stuff. There's whoever's live on whatever specific nights on there. There's YouTube meetups that are coming up that's on there. And there's also, what am I forgetting? He just added something. Um, what'd you add, Ralph? Uh, <laughs> um, hold on. Let me go there. He added something to it. Hello, Adventure America. Hi, Adventure hey, there's America. A, there's another Marine. 
So I, I don't hold it against them. <laughs> Y'all have to ride on the Navy's back anyways. Oh, there's extras on there that is music and stuff. And collaborations. That's the one he just added. That, but we're uh, talking. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, there's also uh, collaborations that are on there. So any collabs that are going on and everything? Oh, he said there's nothing in it yet, though. <laughs> but if you know any collab... Sorry? Mrs. America's Adventure came in. Or Adventure oh. America came in. Hey, Diz. Angela. Hi, Jerry. I thought you were going to go to the uh, Petals of the Past today. No, not until September. The new one I found out from Ian is September fourteenth. Okay. So okay. going from the going from the eleventh to the fifteenth. Got it. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna step down back into the chat. I just got off a of sale, so I'm kind of well. But thank thank you. you for letting me coming up here, Margie. Thank you for coming up and telling us about your channel and everything. And thank you for coming on to my live before you went on to YouTube Police or Belt Loop. And I was like, on panel. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I've got a sale tomorrow at 10 a.m. if anybody wants to check it out. Okay. All righty. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Hey, Peter. <laughs> oh, well. Did you see my short of Susan? Or I should say Susan's short of the snake? Oh. Uh, when did you put that up? Yesterday. I seen somebody short of a snake or something. That was but a, I don't... Where she's screaming, it's coming after me. <laughs> <laughs> I can help but laugh. I, and I still don't know what kind of snake it was. It didn't look like it was a garter snake. It is, the head was like a diamond shape. I, I always told that they have diamond shaped head, they're poisonous. Anyways, I did watch your I did watch your um redo of the garden. Yeah, the garden that we did that yesterday. Yeah, gotta finish it tomorrow. Um, I cooked for thirty people tonight. Oh wow! We brought in one hundred eighty-eight dollars. Awesome. That's not too bad. That's uh, that was eighty-eight dollars profit. It looks like a little ribbon snake, a little garter snake. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. But if you could see the head, it looks di like a diamond. I can't see the head, Jerry. Jerry, yeah, you have to zoom in a bit. <laughs> How am it's I going to zoom in? Head. I looked at it. I thought I thought oh, that's a garter snake. And I started reaching out to get up. And I hold it. That's got a diamond head. Maybe that's not a garter snake. I couldn't see his eyes. How many snakes were there? There was well, one of them. There's one, and the other one. There's six. The first yeah, one was screaming. <laughs> the other says that she's it's coming after me. I think that's what his name. I can't remember. I got I'm getting uh Gary-itis. Oh get it away. It's called get it away. Okay, I'm looking now. I don't know. Okay. That Who's one don't look that one don't look like on that one it don't look like a garter snake because it I mean it's a different color. Yeah, but it what, what is that? I don't know. It, it's I don't hard know to tell, Jerry. No yeah, that one looks venomous. I don't know. It, it, that, it, one it, going, it, that one does look like it was going after her. It was. It was going right after her. It had pinpoint her. Go, hmm, she looks like I could, sweet, sweet enough. I'll eat her. <clears throat> See, that one. That one don't look like a ribbon snake or a garter snake. It's brown and it's brown and yellow, kind of. It, it had red on it too. It had what? It had red, red squares on it. Yeah, I don't think that one's a gutter snake. That one may be a venomous snake. It's hard to I tell. Probably. But uh, the other one, though, the other one with like six snakes, those are yeah, there the are green six and, them. They're all garter green, snakes. Yeah, the green and black ones, those are garter snakes. Yeah, we knew, that, we knew what that was. But that one there, I don't know what it was. And it just decided that she went, zoomed in with the camera and decided, hey, I'm going to pick on you. And they just, it just took off at her after her. She backed up and backed up, you wouldn't believe and screamed. <laughs> well, see, the thing is, is even with gutter snakes, I mean, if they feel threatened, they're going to strike. I mean, even though they're non-venomous and everything, yeah. if you go to pick it up or something like that, it's going to try to bite you. 
just says self defense. Well, I wasn't taking no chance on that on that one. Hey, Bev, thanks for coming in. Oh, Bev. Oh, tired. It was like brown and yellow or something like that. <clears throat> if it was kind of a muddy brown one, it could be, you know, uh, what do they call them? Cotton mouse or a, a copperhead? Copperhead. Well, copperheads are, are, I thought, yeah. were, were golden, golden cream. Yeah, they are kind of, yeah. But it kind of, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. It looked, like, it looked like, at first, it looked like it was poisonous to me. And I was, so I thought, I don't know what it was. I'm not taking no chances. Well, I know I killed a copperhead right out here, right out back. It was it was all up under there. Hello, Miss Venture, Angela. I've seen several snakes on my property, but I've only seen two of them that are venomous. One was a um, um, one was the copperhead out here, and then three or four years ago, it was a uh, coral snake. Well, I don't know what that was, but the six were I know were all garter garter snakes. So they were they were a big deal. And we've got black snakes with that one. I don't know what it was. And yeah. I'm not yeah, a, we have a, a reptile expert, so I have no idea. Yeah, I've seen garter snakes out here. I've seen uh, rat snakes out here. Uh, but those are the two venomous ones I've seen. Uh don't let Ralph up yet because all I see is a black screen. Yeah, me too. And it's not authenticating for some reason. Yeah, it's probably not Ralph. Oh, it is Ralph. <laughs> hey, Ralph. <laughs> it's me. What? I wonder why it's not authenticating his thing. Do I have authentic authentication on? I think so. How do you do that? Is that, that someone new? Yes. Guess must authenticate. No, it wasn't. It wasn't checked, Gary. Well, I just, I just now checked it. I just now checked it, but it wasn't checked. Okay, Des is and Terry's is. Well, I just now checked it. Checked the guess must authenticate. Okay. But I don't know about before. What is that? On a, is that StreamYard? A setting yeah, StreamYard? Uh, yeah, on StreamYard, whenever <laughs> you go to you go to settings and guests, it says okay. uh, there's a box that says guests must authenticate, and that box oh. wasn't checked for some reason. I don't know why. But I didn't know about that. You better check that out, huh? And then when when the people are down below, you just you just click on the three little dots, and then um, it'll show that they're authenticated or not. I don't know why that. Yeah, usually seven. seven oh, you're right. Like, Ralph's Ralph's isn't saying uh, authenticated. I know. Maybe, maybe it was, awesome. but maybe it was because. Yeah. Maybe it was because it wasn't checked before before he came up or whatever. Could be. Hey, Ralph, uh, what's up, brother? Not, <clears throat> not much. <clears throat> Actually, too much. It's just been crazy around here. So. <laughs> Say one thing after another, but <clears throat> I'm used yeah. to it. I think I think we're done with the craziness. We had the garage door replaced today. That got done. So I think that's hopefully that'll Bye. be the last last nuttiness that happens around here for a bit. Wait, it comes in threes, and I think you had it, there I'm was two things three. already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're being garage right. door was three. So I'm, yeah, I'm hoping that holds true. Or <laughs> it's just starting. Did somebody run through the garage door? Or did it just stop? Right. No, it, it just got old and rotted. Oh, okay. <laughs> it was like, I got to get this done before it decides to fall down on one of the cars. So, Yeah, coral snakes are very pretty, but I'd rather much have a king snake there, Gary. They're pretty, too. I just king snake or a milk like snake. It. Yeah, I don't mind snakes as long as they're over there and I'm over here. That's <laughs> I'm the same way. Man, y'all are crazy. I've had. Yeah, I'm, I'm not afraid of them. I just prefer to stay away from them. I've had pet snakes. I my they're first. Like, pet... uh, I'm sorry. They're like right. leaves. You know, two leaves, leave it alone. Yeah. See, two eyes, leave it alone. <laughs> yeah. Two eyes. You got two <laughs> eyes. It's oh. two eyes. Leave. Oh, what'd you say? 
venom and snakes it, typically their pupils are up and down and they have a typically yeah, they have a diamond headed head a diamond get, shaped head you're gonna get close enough to look at their eyes gary their eyes are like this their eyes are like this big gary you want to try to look at yes i pick them up right behind the neck i was told to look at the eyes and they're oval type shape, they're oval eyes, and they're they're not poisonous. But if they got a slit, they're poisonous. You you reach down and pick up venomous snakes, Gary? I do. Nah. Uh-uh. I'll pass. Yeah, I'll pass too. I don't get that close. I, I can recognize the I can recognize generally the venomous snakes around here, which you know, like I said, corals and coral snakes and uh and uh the copperheads. Cottonmouth, copperhead, same thing, basically. Yeah, and, we have those uh, here too. <laughs> yeah, they're they're pretty distinguishable. Even a rattlesnake, yeah. <laughs> and uh, which I don't, I've never seen a rattlesnake around here. Not saying they're not here because I know they're native or they, you know, they're in Texas. But, um. So, but see, here's the thing: when I was in the Marine Corps, uh, me and my roommates fought known snakes. And so I've been around sunbeams, Burmese pythons, ball pythons, red tail boas, Nicaraguan boas. I've had all, you know, all kinds of snakes and, and non venomous snakes. I love snakes. They're cool. Hey, <laughs> Tyler, ben- Marvin. MT, what's up? Oh, Rod, thanks for coming in. <clears throat> but uh, I just don't, I just don't want any venomous snakes. I well, don't want to be close way, to them. Yep. A, uh, a coral snake does have round pupils as opposed to uh, vertical. Yeah, but you yeah, but you can tell a coral snake because uh, red and yellow kill a fellow, red and black friend of Jack, or red and black save Jack, however you want to say it. Yeah. So when when I ran in that coral snake out here, we were burning a bunch of trees, and I went to throw some more wood on the fire, some more trees on the fire, and as soon as I picked up a log or, or a uh, – limb whatever it was i seen it and immediately dropped it and jumped back and the first thing i did was look at the color pattern and it was red and yellow and i'm like nope i yelled for andrew to get me a shovel or whatever and i kept my eyes on it so it didn't get away and he brought me a shovel and i topped his head off easy as that you know and i actually hung it in the tree (laughs) but uh You know, that's I don't have to look at his eyes to know it's a coral snake. <laughs> so right mom, what up, X? Oh, Rod, thanks for coming in. Hey, Xander. Hey, Xander. Yeah, my mom did that with a <clears throat> with a water moccasin. We were down by the Chattahoochee River picking up some what we call wait, monkey grass. Wait. Way down yonder by the Chattahoochee? <laughs> yep. <clears throat> yes, absolutely. <laughs> it's about a mile from my house here. <laughs> Uh, when I was a kid, we were down, we were picking up what we call monkey grass. It's just a, a grass that grows by the river. It's a good green fill thing. <clears throat> and my mom grew up on a farm. She's not afraid of bugs, snakes, nothing, man. But water moccasins are poisonous. Yeah. And it's the only time I've ever heard my mother scream like that. And it was like she picked it up. And when she picked it up, it dropped out of the clump of grass she had. And the grass went one way and the snake went in the river. And my mom went that way. And- <laughs> screamed by heavens and my mom and my dad and I turned around and we were like oh snake <laughs> but yeah no she didn't like that that was like a little too close a little bit too close well guys we got about five minutes left and uh All right, before you kick off for five minutes hold on, hold on, right. Gary, hold on, Gary hold on. are you going live or no I went for a little bit. Yeah, that's what I was fixing to say. Uh, We got about five minutes, and everybody that's in YouTube chat, stay there because (laughs) the redirect is on. So as soon as I end this live, it'll automatically kick you over to Gary's live, Bellow 29. And uh, go ahead, Jerry. Say what you're going to say. I was going to say, Ralph, how how was it meet me for me, me, Eddie? I'm sorry, buddy. I just <laughs> couldn't let it slide, could you? Just couldn't <laughs> let it slide. I don't know what I happened, Jerry. 
<laughs> you thought he'd make a comment and hide real quick. <laughs> yeah, you're funny, Jerry. <laughs> I didn't say anything. I said Jerry, not Jerry. Gary, but you're funny too. I try to be. <laughs> I was I was trying to identify that snake and I couldn't either, Jerry. I have no I have no clue. <laughs> I'm like mm -mm. I need somebody who knows about the snakes to let me know what they think it is. I, I, you know, I, I didn't kill it because I was, I wasn't sure what it was. It was I didn't want to kill it as a garden snake because I, I wanted to eat the mice that we have around here. Well, what you do is you put a stick or something over it, grab it right by the head, and pick it up and look at it. I'll, I'll tell you what. Next time I find see it, I'll put a stick on it and call you, and you can come over and do it. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know, if I'm, I don't switch around my thing. You know, hey, at work they typically give. They used to give me all the animal animal control calls because you know I'll pick up a snake. I'll you know I've sat there and let skunks out of traps. I've gone you know animal critters. There's just something that you know I deal with on a regular basis. That's um, why you have a critter critter channel. Well. Yeah, I mean that's why I have my critter channel. You're right. I love I have it. A channel. And uh, anyhow, the funnest call I ever remember on an animal control call, there was a real pretty lady doctor that uh, there was a bat loose in her house. You know, she had just gone to bed and she was in some Daisy Dukes and a uh, one of them tank top. You know, and she had just laid down to go to bed and was reading reading started reading something something started flying around her room he at first she thought it was a bird but then she realized it wasn't she ran out the house and called i had to go down i just stood in the living room and let the door open and chase the bat around till it flew out but it was a fun call it took a long time to get it it didn't take it long too it's long you to couldn't keep your eyes on the bat do i now couldn't keep your eyes on the bat well I mean, I, I've got Batman, Gary, Batman. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I got about two minutes, Gary, before yeah. you go live. And unless you want to want everybody to go in late, uh, hush. All right, All right, guys. Type in chat if you'd like to, me to recognize you. I'd like to thank, uh, yes, I can, Barbecue Simon for the $1.99 super chat. I'd like to thank Peaceful Dez for the $5 super chat. Skip, Great Wolf Outdoors, been a member for 13 months. Des been a member for 15 months with many more months to come. Uh, Ralph's been a member for 17 months. Gary's been a member for 17 months. And Peter's been a member for 16 months. Thanks to all my members. Thanks, Des and Simon, for the super chats. And now, uh, Adventure America, Semper Fi brother, another Marine. Cooking with Stephen and Jacqueline. I don't know why you're not a mod. I will try to rectify that. X Dark Lord Manet. Manette, thanks for coming in. Double Dog Prepper, Judy Mae Collins, a longtime friend and member of the channel. MT Living and Cooking, Mrs. Adventures America, Angela, and Peaceful Des. Thank you all very much for being here. Like I said, sit right there and it'll automatically kick you over to. Gary's live, and I'm going to try to find them real quick to mod them up. There he is, cooking with Stephen and Jacqueline. That Blaney. is mod. Blaney. There we go. I'm sorry? Masio Family Adventures, thank you all for coming in. Uh, Chef, Bev, uh, everybody else, uh, appreciate it. But it is 8.30, time to go over to Gary's chat. So Semper Fi until next Saturday, 7 o'clock. Thank everybody for coming in. See you then. And with that being said, Devil Dog out. <laughs> <laughs>